Hello students, today we are going to solve example on right circular cylinder. So from the given information how to obtain the equation of right circular cylinder that we are going to see. So let us consider the example. Obtain the equation of right circular cylinder of radius phi u and axis is the line x minus 2 is equal to 2 into y minus 3 is equal to 2 into z plus 1. So let us see the solution. In the solution, first of all, we will see the figure. So this one is the uh, sketch of the right circular cylinder. This AB is the axis of cylinder. This constant distance PQ, it is the radius of the cylinder. This P of X, Y, Z is any arbitrary point on the surface of the cylinder. And this line, it is the generator. When we revolve this generator uh, around, uh, the axis AB then whatever the surface we will be getting it is called as the right circular cylinder. So we want to obtain equation of such right circular cylinder from the given information. So here given the radius of the cylinder is phi u. So PQ which is the constant distance is the radius hence PQ is equal to phi u R equal to PQ equal to phi u. Now next we want to obtain the direction ratios for this axis AB. So equation of axis is this one x minus 2 equal to 2 into y minus 3 equal to 2 into z plus 1. We want to express it into symmetrical form. We know that if the line is passing through the fixed point A alpha beta gamma and if its DRS are suppose small ABC then its equation is given by x minus alpha upon a equal to y minus beta upon b equal to z minus gamma upon c. So here we have to take note of this thing that the coefficients of this x, y, z they are 1. So to make your coefficients of x, y, z as 1, we will take the LCM of coefficients of x, y, z which is 2 here in this case and we will divide throughout by that LCM. So therefore the equation of this line in the symmetrical form is x minus 2 upon 2 equal to y minus 3 upon 1 equal to z plus 1 upon 1. Now if we compare this equation uh, with this general form then the DRS of the axis AB they are the denominators and which is ABC equal to 2 1 1. Now and what is the fixed point? So this A alpha beta gamma so here it is alpha beta gamma and if we compare these two things what will be alpha beta gamma so it is 2 3 minus 1 so see so fixed point on the axis ab is a alpha beta gamma equal to 2 3 minus 1 now let us consider the triangle from the right circular cylinder again in this we have considered this p of x y z as the arbitrary point on the surface of this cylinder now we want to obtain the direction ratios for this line segment AP and which are obtained subtracting the coordinates of the points A from the coordinates of the point P and which are X minus alpha, Y minus beta, Z minus gamma. So therefore direction ratios of the line AP are X minus alpha comma Y minus beta comma Z minus gamma. Now we will go for obtaining length of each of the line segment from this triangle AP, AQ and PQ. So the PQ is the given distance which is the radius of the cylinder. So PQ is equal to phi u. Now this AQ is what? It is the length of the projection of this line segment AP on the axis of the cylinder AB. And how it will be obtained? It is given by the formula. In this formula, the numerator is what? It is the sum of product of direction ratios of the axis of axis AB and the direction ratios of this line segment AP. So therefore, numerator is A into X minus alpha plus B into Y minus beta plus C into Z minus gamma divided by in the denominator it is square root of sum of squares of the direction ratios of the axis AB. Therefore it is square root of A square plus B square plus C square. If we replace the values of this A, B, C and alpha, beta, gamma 
that will give us this expression and simplifying it we will be getting it as 2x plus y plus z minus 6 divided by root 6. Now we will go for obtaining the distance AP. So by distance formula AP will be evaluated as square root of x minus alpha bracket square plus y minus beta bracket square plus z minus gamma bracket square. Replace the values of alpha, beta, gamma that will give us the distance AP as square root of x minus 2 bracket square plus y minus 3 bracket square plus z plus 1 bracket square. Now we have obtained all the distances from this triangle APQ. So consider this triangle in which this angle AQP is 90 degree and therefore by Pythagoras theorem AP square is equal to AQ square plus PQ square. Replace their values. The we will get the expression. Uh, this expression. Now in this expression to simplify this term uh, we have to obtain square of the four terms and which will be evaluated using the formula a plus b plus c plus d bracket square is equal to a square plus b square plus c square plus d square plus 2 times a b plus 2 times a c plus 2 times a d plus 2 times b c plus 2 times b d plus 2 times c d. Further to simplify this expression we need to multiply throughout by square of this root 6. So therefore it will give us the expression 6 into x square plus y square plus z square minus 4x minus 6y plus 2z plus 14 equal to 4x square plus y square plus z square plus 4xy plus 4xz minus 24x plus 2yz minus 12y minus 12z plus 36 plus 150. Now we will take all the terms from the right hand side to the left hand side and we will collect the coefficients of the same term. So that will give us the expression 2x square plus 5y square plus 5z square minus 4xy minus 4xz minus 2yz minus 24y plus 24z minus 102 equal to 0. So in this way we can obtain the equation of required right circular cylinder from the given information. I hope you have understood this. Thanks for watching the video.